Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, two Crazy, crazy Ketos. Ketos. Today we're going to head off to Sprouts Market. Because we've never been there before. Yeah, and a lot of you guys talk about Sprouts Market, so we looked on Apple Maps and found out there's one about 40 minutes away. So we're going on a field trip right, right after, after this. this. So if you're new to our channel, welcome. Like I said, my name is Joe. And I'm Rachel. And we're Two Crazy Ketos. And here on our channel, we do different things like product reviews. We do recipe videos. We talk about various keto topics. Once in a while, we do a vlog, kind of like we're going to do today. And then every week, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch, where we just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us on different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we also have a website, which is TwoCrazyKetos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week. So make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Yeah, so like I said, today we're going to head off to Sprouts Market. A lot of our subscribers talk about Sprouts, and we've never been there. Yeah, we've got to fix that. Yeah, so we looked on Apple Maps and found out there's one up in Wellington, Florida, which is about 40 minutes away. It's a little bit country up there, so I'm wearing my cowgirl hat. I love your outfit. I think it's going to be a hat summer. Yeah, so this is kind of weird, though, with you sitting in the back seat, and in order to look at you, I have to, like, look at you in the monitor on Hi, the camera. I'm back here stalking you. <laughs> <laughs> but this is probably the best way for us to do the filming because, you know, the phone is only so wide and my truck is really wide. So it's driving Miss Rachel. Yeah. So you can have a little different kind of like a vlog travel with us today. So we're going to head up there and uh, see what they have to offer there. Come I heard they us. have some Zevia on sales. So Help we're carry in the groceries. <laughs> okay. You ready? All right. Let's, let's do go. it. seat driving. <laughs> you and your hat. You just want everybody to see your hat. Yeehaw! I'm like very excited about my hat. I do think this is going to be a summer of hats. I need to get a sun hat and a baseball cap and maybe one of those hats that have the thing on the top that you can twirl. What do you think? Something is wrong with you. Clearly. I thought we were all the way to like, I don't know, Boynton Beach, but we're, we're not out of Boca yet. We've been in the car for five minutes. Seems like a long time. <laughs> I don't do well in the car. Yeah, Rachel doesn't like long car rides. We wouldn't be driving to Texas. I would love to drive to Texas. Someone's going home in a body bag. It would just be really nice with us just driving across the country. No. We tried like coming straight home from New York once. Yeah, that was the last long car ride we did was we drove to Three New York kids. and we drove back and coming home we drove straight back. The smell in that car, I think we immediately sold that vehicle as soon as we like pulled into the driveway. I braided all of my hair like Coolio and I ate an entire suitcase of White Castle burgers. You loved your White Castle though. I can't eat, I can't even eat steamed hamburger meat anymore because I think I ate my lifetime of steamed hamburger meat in that one city. Well, every time we used to go to New York, you used to always want to go to White Castle. One time we took them on the plane. Remember we got a suitcase worth of White Castle and you carried it on the plane like carry-on luggage and How everybody was looking was at that, you. How was that, right? Like, <laughs> imagine if you don't like the smell of White Castle and then someone sits next to you with a suitcase. That was so rude. White Castles were really good. They weren't really heavy on the meat. Lots of lots of bread, but ooh, that tastes. It was mostly like bread and those little onions. 
Yeah. Like you knew you had been at White Castle because your your whole all of your pores like would sweat that stuff. Like you smelled it. So what do you think that Sprouts is going to be like? Do you think it's going to be like a Publix? I've never been there, so I have no idea. I mean, I've seen everybody talk about it. I've seen other keto people talk about like, oh, I'm going to Sprouts. So is it outdoor? I don't think so. I mean, I was looking on their website. It says Sprouts Farmers Market, but I think it's kind of like a Whole Foods or a Lucky's kind of thing. Oh, or like Trader Joe's? Yeah, I guess something like that. So I don't know what to expect. I do know I saw in the ad that Zevia is on sale 40% off. Now we're going to have to get more because I actually found two flavors I really like. Yeah, so I had like, when I bought all my Zevia, I bought like a couple of six packs of each flavor. And Rachel discovered this week that she really likes the root beer and the cream soda. So now we have to go stock up on that. I know. I'm sorry. I really thought that I was never going to find like a Zevia flavor that I would like at all. But I'm actually hoping all the Zevias are on sale for 40% off because I discovered something that I really like, but they're kind of expensive, is the Zevia iced teas. They have like the raspberry, the green tea. I think what else? There was a black tea and oh, a blood orange. That one was really good. Those, those are, those are all you. you but get they to were like a dollar fifty a can in Whole Foods, so I'm hoping that like maybe they're forty percent off, and I can pick up just a few cans. I mean, not drink them like as much as a soda, but just for a change. They're, I mean, they were pretty packaging. Yeah, you know what else we discovered we liked was the Zevia, the the tonic water. Yes. That tonic water is awesome. Really good, especially when you add some of those the lime packets. Yeah. From um the true lime. The yeah, true they're lemon. really good, but they're expensive too. It's like $5 for an eight they're pack. Tiny. And they're like little, like what, eight ounce cans or something like that? They're baby cans. So maybe we can get some more of that stuff too. Cause I'm no way I'm paying $5 for eight little tiny cans like that. I'm getting excited about what we're eating for dinner tonight. Yeah, so we're having steak tonight. We had gone to Lucky's the other day with my mom and Lucky. they had, <laughs> They had grass-fed, grass-finished New York strips. We'll put a picture of what it looks like. And they were so, like, thick. Like, they're, like, two inches thick. And they were on sale for $6.99 a pound for grass-fed, grass-finished. So we picked up two of them, and we're going to sous vide one up tonight and throw it on the grill afterwards. Yum! That thing looks incredible. I can't wait to see what it tastes like. Do you think that Sprouts has their own brand of stuff like Trader Joe's or... Like Aldi's? I have no idea. I've never been there. I mean, are you asking me or are you asking them? I'm asking you. Because if you're asking them, like they're going to answer you and we will have already been there. So we're going to know the answer. I'm I have no you. idea. Well, it's kind of like when we watch a movie and, and I'm asking you like, what do you think happens next? And like, we're watching it for the first time at the same time. That is the most annoying thing. Let me ask you guys something. Do your spouse do that? Do you sit down and watch a movie with somebody and they're like, What's gonna happen? And you haven't seen it before. Like, how are you supposed to answer what's gonna happen? All you're doing is disturbing me, and now I'm going to miss what actually happens. <laughs> this is why we watch movies at home instead of going to the movie theaters, because oh, we have, have to, to hit pause and rewind like a hundred times. What other movie were they in? <laughs> that that always hits me. Like I have to place them. Like, yeah, where I can't was tell the actor? you. How many times do we watch a movie and you're like, what movie? And it's like, wait, hold on, pause. I got to look up on IMDb what movie that person was in. And Rachel has the uncanny ability of spotting somebody who hasn't been in a movie for like 30 years and knowing who it is. It's a, it's a, it's a stupid human trick that I have. Like, like I could see, you know, I mean, Elizabeth Taylor's easy to spot, but like I can remember, you know, spotting her in like the Jane Eyre movie with Orson Welles right and my mom going like oh my gosh like yeah that is that's Elizabeth Taylor she's just really teeny tiny you're very good you could be your own facial recognition software okay side note my phone never recognizes my face that's what is going on there you have a different hair color and hairstyle and everything my face every is time. the same we probably had the phone like scan your face like in the middle of the night or first thing in the morning when you had like a scary Rachel face on. Hey! <laughs> Speaking of facial recognitions, my mom and my sister were here and my sister's phone all of a sudden decided like the battery was shot on it. She had an iPhone 6. It was like, nope, I'm done. So it was like within five minutes, the battery would go from 100% to 30%. So I took her to get new phones Crazy. for her and my mom and they got the new iPhone XR. And it was hysterical trying to teach my mother how to do the facial recognition. 
She's like, look where? She's where like, what look? do you mean look? It took like five minutes to teach it to program her, to like to program her face into it. And she's like, what? what? You mean all I have to do is pick up the phone? I'm like, yeah, just pick up your phone and it's going to automatically know it's you. And I don't have to enter the code. Nope, you don't have to enter the Did code. Did it work for her? It does work. My phone doesn't like my face. You're like, change that and come back. Well, I like your face. Thank you. My phone is like, I don't even know you anymore. So last night before I went to bed, I don't know if you saw this, I was looking on Facebook at our family group and your brother put a thing on his Facebook that uh, Jay and Silent Bob just bought some of his like comic books on his what? eBay store. How is that cool like cool? Is that? Yeah, they bought like two auctions. So you're gonna be shipping out some stuff to Jay and Silent Bob. Oh my goodness. Now I wanna watch Clerks. If you guys like comic books and want some cheap comic books, you should check out Rachel's brother's like eBay store. It's, nice and cheap. It's Porky's Comics and he's got some great deals on there. We'll leave a link down below for it. The little man in the GPS says that we're only three minutes away. I love the little man in your GPS. She uses a British accent Siri. I like to hear him talk. <laughs> well, I, should, I guess mine isn't any better. I used the female British accent one. There you go. This is not nearly as far as I thought it was, though. I mean, I thought we've been going here. I thought, well, we didn't know it existed, but I thought it was like 40 minutes away, and we've only been driving for like 20 minutes. It's like there's a Trader Joe's here too. There's a, actually the Trader Joe's is right over here in this corner. This what? When we, when they first started opening Trader Joe's in Florida, this was the only one. Remember, we used to drive all the way up to this one, and we always liked Trader Joe's because there's been one by my mom's house in New York for like. 10 years. I can't remember how here feels like. You know, I get lost. It doesn't matter how many times I've been to a place. But yeah, this was really quick. We're going to have to start making this maybe like a monthly trip if we even like Sprouts. I don't, I'm again, I don't know. Yeah, what if it stinks? Speaking of my sister, I thought it was interesting. Like when she was here, we took her to Whole Foods and we were telling her all about like the deals that you can get as a prime member there. The closest Whole Foods to her is like an hour away, she said. Really? Even I, in New York? I don't understand how they, like they, they live everything. on Long Island. They don't live like out in the boonies, like way out east. I mean, they live in a pretty populated area. Yeah. And I can't believe that there is no Whole Foods anywhere there. There's actually a Whole Foods right there. Where? Over there. Oh, wow. We <laughs> could make this a trip. We can do like Whole Foods and we can do Trader Joe's. I guess we don't have enough time for all that. I don't we think we have try. enough budget for no, all of that. No, we don't have enough budget for that. S speaking of budget, is there? do I have a budget going in here to Sprouts? $5. I don't think you can buy anything in these places for $5. I don't $5. think so Well, do you have like a group of food that you would like to get? Like you're not just looking for snacks right now. In our cut down to KetoCon, you're not looking no, for snacks, No, really. but I just kind of want to walk through and see what they have, which is really dangerous for us. I think our, our new greatest friend now is finding out that you can do like the Prime Now delivery with Whole Foods because we live so close to Whole Foods and with $35, it's free delivery. So if you don't have to lug the cases of soda in. Well, forget you'll... that. I think we're saving money, even though we're spending $35 at a pop for Prime Now. I think we're saving money because we're not walking through the store going, oh, look at this. Oh, look at this. True. I liked going to Whole Foods with them. As like, you know, you get off the off the airplane and you're hungry and you want to go and get something to eat. Right. But like, it's really like a buffet almost there. I mean, really, it, any well, diet Well, it was great for them. I mean, we didn't eat, but I mean, they loved it. I don't think my mom had ever even been in Whole Foods before. So she really thought it was interesting. And she was like, wow, the prices aren't as bad as I thought they were. Which, because they've come way down since Amazon they like have. bought them. And again, if you're an Amazon Prime member, I mean... But, I the mean, sales are incredible. We could have gotten just like, I mean, we didn't need to eat yet, but like we could have gotten just like some lettuce, whatever kind of lettuce you want and, and getting like a, a grilled chicken breast with nothing on it. Even, yeah, you know. I think it's a great place. That's what I've said. Like if you're going to take somebody out for lunch and you just want everybody to have a variety, but good healthy food, that is the place to go. There's something for everybody. Yeah. We made it to Sprouts. We're here. Look what I found. I've been looking for these. Get all three. Get that other one. Yay! Dollar 19. I've been wanting to try this Bubby's sauerkraut. This looks good, this like spicy kosher dill. Let's try those. Okay, so they do have their own brand of stuff. This is Sprouts Tzatziki. Let's try that. Made with What's three the nutrition. Dinner? Two carbs. I like it. Okay, what about this up here? 
almond dip. They have three different kinds. That one's jalapeno. Let's try that. Ooh, nice. It's on sale. It's good. They have the Koya, look at the price. They're $2.99, but they don't have the keto the ones. But look, they have these. Check out those, go look at those. <laughs> keto, spelled with two eyes. What are the carbs on those? Two, three, two. You wanna try those? They're on sale too, $2.99. Yeah. They have all different kinds of flavors of the Calthea. These Vermont's minis are good. What's the carbs on them? Cause they're on clearance. Zero. Ooh, get some of those. What about the pepperoni ones? Is there sugar in them? Salt, pepper, king and sugar. Two. What's the carbs on them? Two and one. So we'll let's go with the, the meat one. sticks. I saw these in Whole Foods. Take a look at those cauliflower crackers. Any keto person is going to pick that up, right? Look at the carbohydrates on them. Because look at the ingredients. Like cauliflower flour, whole grain rice flour. But how many people are going to pick that up on keto? I kind of like the fact that a serving size though is 44 crackers. I think that we need a serving size of 44 anything. Here's another one that I think that like just seeing avocado crisps, someone would like. I would absolutely up. pick that up. Absolutely, but like look at that. So serving size is 12 crisps and there's 10 carbohydrates. The, the, the whole bag is 22 carbs and six grams of fiber, so that's ridiculous. That's and a I, lot of carbs. And I would eat the entire bag. Well, that was fun. That place was awesome. Everybody was right. It was a cool place. It's, yeah. It was like a grocery store. It was like a Lucky's. I, yeah, it's, it's like a Lucky's or a Whole Foods. More like a Lucky's, I'd say, right? Yeah. Or even a Trader Joe's. Mm -hmm. But I liked it. Now, I mean, some of the stuff is expensive, but I think it's just like going to Whole Foods. Like, you gotta buy the deals. It's like any grocery store, you know, things are up and down. But they did have a lot of things that were either discounted or on, like, clearance. Yeah, well, I mean, and I, what I noticed was when something is on sale, it was really on sale. Yeah. So you wanna go through some of the stuff we got? Absolutely. Hey, the first thing, we have been looking for this stuff forever. Stevia energy the, drinks. So Stevia energy drinks, because you used to like to drink the bangs, but the bangs do have, like, a lot of chemicals and stuff. So which one are you? Got? I've got Bang. the grapefruit. I have raspberry lime. Yeah, and they were on sale for $1.19 a can, which is a lot cheaper than the Bang. Seriously. Yeah, because the Bang, sometimes depending on where you get them, are like almost $3. Well, do you want to open up just one can? Because I'm worried that it is stevia flavor sweetened and you may not like it. All right, let's open this one because this is the one I want to try. Raspberry lime. That's good. Oh, so now I now have to open up my can, right? Now you have to open up your can. That's actually good. That is, we're gonna have to make trips to Sprouts just for this because Whole Foods doesn't carry it. At least our Whole Foods doesn't carry I've it. I've never seen it. Okay, grapefruit. We also got, there was another flavor. They had uh, two cans of the cola flavored, but they weren't cold. And they also had mango ginger. This is zero carbohydrates, zero sugars. And it says that the ingredients are carbonated water, citric acid, organic, stevia leaf extract, organic caffeine, and natural flavor. This is good. It almost tastes like uh, like a fresca. Ooh. Yeah, this one's yours now. What? This is really good. Okay, well, I'm glad I went and got some more. So we bought a bunch of those. So go. let's go through wow. what else we have. Okay, well, we found the tea that you really like that you get to keep all to yourself because I'm not a huge fan. Yes, yeah, so we bought a bunch of the Zevia teas. We did get them at Whole Foods last, you know, this week because they were on sale. Mm -hmm. But they were on sale here too for like a dollar a can. But we didn't buy any Zevia because the Zevia was actually more expensive here than it is. 50 cents on, more. Yeah, it was like 50 cents more. So Whole Foods still has it on sale. It's like 20 cents more than it was last week, but it's still on sale for like $3.30. We didn't buy any more Zevia. And the Whole Foods will deliver it right to your house. Yeah. <laughs> and then we won't spend $130 like we just did in Sprouts. Oh my gosh. Is that how much we spent? Yeah. But we did buy a bunch of good stuff. So we got... This is a new one that I wanted to try. Super creamer. This was... It's a super tr creamer protein and MCT oil. It's 50 calories for three tablespoons. What? So uh, <laughs> five grams of fat, zero carbohydrates, three grams of protein, and the ingredients are water, whey protein concentrate, cream, coconut, uh, coconut MCT oil, some monk fruit, uh, natural vanilla flavoring, and potassium phosphate. 
Three tablespoons is a serving. Three tablespoons is a serving for 50 that's calories and no carbs. So that's now better than heavy cream. So yeah, we may have to stop and get some coffee just to try that. So we I got have this. some. I have some. You want to put it in mine? Really? Yeah. Well, let's shake it up. I won't shake this yet. I got to put the lid on it first. Yes, please don't do that. There's still a coffee stain up here from that. That's How are we going to measure? We'll just do one, two. There you go. I may have to run back in and get this. This was on sale. If it's good. Uh. <laughs> Always pops. That's pretty good. Oh, that is really good. And we put probably about two tablespoons to like 20 ounces of coffee. Yeah, that's nice. That's really good. That's good. Okay, what else we get? So we don't make this like a 50 minute video. Too late. My sister said to us today, like, how did you turn a coffee video into 18 minutes? I'm like, we can talk. Magic. <laughs> All right, so this is keto spelled with two eyes. Yep. It's a new drink. Yeah, so we were looking, they had the Koya, right? Yep. But they didn't have any of the keto flavors. So we saw this, it's the same kind of thing, plant powered super fuel. But I really like this, we had, what were the other flavors? There were like three different they flavors. They have, what's that flavor called? This is the vanilla. Vanilla, and then it's got like an Ikea name on the bottom of it. Yeah. Like Asher Walker Gonda. Yeah. So. Then this is uh, Matcha Morning. Matcha Morning. Morning Ga or something. And then we got a chocolate. Chocolate. But Maca. what I liked about this, I mean, we could drink this right now on our cut because it's 210 calories for the whole bottle, 13 grams of fat, 20 grams of protein. Two total carbohydrates. Nuh uh. Two total carbohydrates. It's coconut milk, pea protein, vanilla extract, rose extract, maple extract, Himalayan pink salt, vanilla bean, monk fruit, and cinnamon oil. We gotta give one of those to my mom. This we got too. I love this brand coffee creamer. It's like almond milk and uh, heavy coconut cream. But this is two grams of carbohydrates per serving, and it's one tablespoon. So that's why I'm really interested in that other one. Yeah. So, but um, this is a new flavor that we have never tried, pecan caramel. We usually only get the vanilla. We did get some of... This is piling up in my car. The minis. The yeah, Vermont these Vermont meat, meat sticks, they were on sale. They were on clearance, right? Like $3 off a package. Yeah, so they were $3 We got a bunch of them, especially with football season coming up. Ooh, we got some... Like, this was their brand of, It's like, like a Zip Fizz. Or, or, I would say more like Ultima. I don't know. It says Fizzy, though. Ultima's oh. not Fizzy. So, oh, okay. I'm thinking it's, like, Zip Fizz kind of thing. Um, but there's, like, 200 milligrams of potassium in each one. But they were on sale for How 39 cents. How does that compare cents. to the Zip Fizz? A Zip Fizz is, like, 900. But, they, or, but they're 39 cents for them. So, we figured we just got the little packets and tried each flavor. Yeah. Got some Lilies. Lilies was on sale, like, $3 off a bag. And then I got a present for you. You went to the bathroom and I got a present for you. Is this my present? That was your present. Yeah. They were two for five. That is like dirt cheap. Yeah, but 18 total carbs. Yeah, but it's like three net carbs. But we're not going to eat it all. That's a treat for like your time of the month when you definitely need your chocolate. True that. So, yep. So we got, they had two different kinds. They had 40% and they had the 70%. So I got you the 70%. That's I think well that's carbs. it because everything else is repeats. Everything else is repeat. Like more, you know, couple of. Oh wait, no, like we, we got, got the mixer. Else. Oh yeah, this is a new mixer we've never tried before. Lemon lime with bitters. So we're gonna try that one. That was on sale for like three sixty or something. I think is that it. I felt like we got more stuff. No, we just, just spent a, a lot. Mix. Oh no, you're right. Oh yeah. We got. I can't wait to try this. We have to try this tonight with the steak. Okay, we're gonna have that with steak tonight. Spicy sauerkraut. Spicy sauerkraut. It was a bit expensive, but I'm. Bubbies. Bubbies, it's one carbohydrate for a quarter of a cup. Oops, spicy kosher dill. And spicy kosher dill pickles. Then this almond dip. Yeah, this looks really good. So this almond dip was three total carbohydrates for two tablespoons, but just like a little treat for ourselves. It's almond with uh, chia and hemp. Was there any fiber in this? One gram of fiber, so two total carbs, or two net carbs. I'm not as excited about that as I am the sauerkraut, but. This one, ooh, I'm gonna put this on my steak tonight. Tzatziki. Tzatziki. And this was pretty low too, right? This was two total carbs? Yeah. Two total carbs. Now we have to get all of this stuff home. Yeah, 
So that's our video for today. We are going to head home, but I think first we're going to stop at like Trader Joe's, right? Yeah, just a quickie though. Yeah, it's like right across the street. So, I mean, you guys have all been in Trader Joe's. Maybe we'll do another video one day about yeah. going to Trader Joe's. But let us know down below, like what are your favorite things to get at Sprouts? I mean, this was our first time there and I'm, I'm sure, sure we missed stuff. Yeah, I'm sure we missed like a bunch of stuff. What are some of the better deals? Is there like a better day to go? Because mm -hmm. I'm sure we're going to come back up here, especially now that we know it's only like a 25 minute drive. Very right? close. We're going to have to sign up for their like circular so if you like what you saw do us a favor hit that like button down below and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video you'll be alerted to it until next time bye bye, bye.